guys, this is Shaiyu. Today I'll be showing you how to download SoundCloud MP3 into your iPhone. First you need to download this application called Documents. And you can do that by going to the App Store and downloading it straight from there. Um, just to keep in mind, the compatibility of this application is for any, any device that's iOS 11 and above. Alright, so once you have it downloaded, let's go ahead and open it up. And when it's your first time, you know, opening the application, it's going to ask you some preferences. So as you can see, it's uh, saying, go ahead, continue to the uh, to all your files. And then it's going to ask you, what would you be using? What will you be using in this application for? Is it, is it to listen to music or work with PDF and Office files? Honestly, guy, it really doesn't matter. So you can choose whatever you want to do. I'm going to select listen to music since I already have files in Google Drive in my iPhone. And select the continue option and not care too much about the notification. All right, so once you have it opened up, it looks very similar uh, to the files, you know, application that we have in our iPhone. Um, and it's honestly, it's pretty awesome. You can create your folders and do a bunch of different things in this uh, application. So I'm gonna go ahead and do just that. I'm gonna create a new folder called music and that's where I'm going to be downloading my music to. Honestly, it really, doesn't matter you don't necessarily have to do it in default it downloads everything into the downloads folder um, but since I'm sort of a neat freak I'm just gonna download every all my music in here and say if I want to download videos I will just do that in a new folder called videos so anyway let's go ahead and open up this web browser by swiping to the right from the bottom and type in SoundCloud to mp3 all right, I'm going to now go to SoundCloud and pick a uh, song that I want to download. I'm not trying to get in trouble, so I'll just download some of my traditional music, so I'm not going to get any copyright issues. So I'm going to select a, you know, a music that is available to me and select the share option and then copy. So now I'm going to go back to the documents application and select the very first link here, SoundCloud Downloader, and then paste my music in here. Select Download option, and as you can see, it's already here. What we need to do is make sure that we select the Download Manually option. So we'll do that, and as you can see, it's asking uh, us to name the file, and as, you know, the extension of this file is .mp3, and that's what we want to make sure that it is. It has to be a .mp3 or else obviously it's not going to play as a music. So here, as you can see, the second option we have is Save To. Um, this is where I'm going to be selecting the new folder that I created and then select the Done option on the top right side. And as you can see, it's downloading. It downloads pretty fast. And I'm just going to clear the downloads and then go back to the folder. And within Music, Kind of weird that it actually still downloaded into the downloads rather than to the music. But oh well, if you are again a new freak like me, you have the option to kind of move the fo move the file into the music folder. So to do that, you just select the folder and select the, mu the move option and go back into the music folder and voila, it's right there. I'm going to select the file and I'm going to obviously post the video. All right. As you can see, there's the functionality to skip and to go back into a previous track, play, you know, control the music. Pretty much every feature or every single functionality that you would have within the music application in your iPhone. Uh, hopefully this will, you know, play a good alternative for you guys. And if it does, um, you know, let me know in the comment section below. All right. Thank you so much for watching the video, guys. Please like and subscribe and turn on the notification bell on the bottom right there. That's my first time saying turn on the notification. I am trying to upload videos more often and more frequently now. So uh, hopefully some of these videos can help you in the future. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you guys in this one. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.